Okay, Rita, this is in response to worst date ever. Uh, my worst date ever, I ended up marrying. So, woof, 14 years long it lasted. That is one hell of a date. But anyway, my so my second worst date, I think one is the guy who wanted to go out to dinner and a movie with me. And when he came to pick me up uh, in his $55,000 Infinity, the first thing he said to me was, I'm not hungry anymore because I just had a giant frozen yogurt at Costco. <clears throat> Meanwhile, of course, I'm starving because I'm thinking, oh, we're going to go to dinner and, you know, then a movie. And then he goes, uh, yeah, instead of seeing that film we talked about, why don't we go to this other one? I heard it's really good, and if we hurry, we can get there before it starts. And I was like, um, okay. So we get to the movie theater, and he goes to pay for the tickets with coupons that he had gotten in exchange for donating blood at our local hospital. So basically, the reason we went to see this movie was because these coupons were only redeemable at this particular theater. So, big spender here. I'm getting nervous because I'm hungry, but I'm like, you know, oh my god. You know, so I go to, I order a hot dog, and I'm thinking, do I order the small drink or the medium drink? And then, of course, the guy at the counter is like, it's only a quarter more, you know, which is giving, like, setting this guy into apoplectic shock, you know. He's like having a seizure over it, and I'm like, you know what? Seize all you want, douchebag. I'm getting the, I'm getting the large. So um, we, I get the large and I get a hot dog and uh, we go see the movie and it blows and uh, we go back to the car and the guy tries to like, you know, dry hump me and all I can think is, you know, dude, you know, you might be cheap, but I'm not. Date over. And that, my dear, is my second worst date ever.